friends on YouTube, we are live on Twitch today. Today is Saturday. We had a really nice, energetic, worry, vibey, dancey start to our stream today. And right now we are going to be playing some farming of grid challenge. I am very excited. In the last episode, we were finally able to get some proper money and build our first greenhouse today we will see what comes i also have placed some families into the save file some of them were just random families from uh from the gallery but two of them were also from our viewers and i created a little club of like mummies um of these families so i would be also excited to make maybe some meetup for them something like that so we will see what comes and also youtube friends if you would ever like to join us here on twitch we would absolutely love to have you here there are even lovely friends here um welcoming you to this youtube video and uh, if you would like to join us join this chat all the instructions on how to do that are in uh, the description of this youtube video is very very easy you could be here really next time that we are playing so thank you very much for watching and i already have my yes we are lovely friends they are lovely friends trust me they are very very lovely people no matter what they say or write they are very lovely and i just love being here all the time friends i'm starting sims we are in the sims already they are lovely friends so we are in our family once again uh we have some families this is one of them this one is just like some random family from the gallery um here is one random family from the gallery um then here is a family by empress and here is a family by sif so i already added i did some like background work and i added all of them into this uh, little club that we created. It's called, I think, Mums of Hamford. Uh, let's check. Uh, doo -doo 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 here. Yeah, Mums of Hamford. Let me show you. And here are all the mums. Uh, we were creating this kind of like small story. You gave my sim pants. Yes, if the only thing that was missing on your sim, because friends, if you are creating any sims for me, uh, for any of my gameplay, I don't have all the packs so far uh, at the point when this is recorded, uh, being recorded. I don't have any all the packs. The list of all the packs I have is on my main YouTube in the about section. So the only thing that was missing on Karen because I don't have the pack is her pants for her everyday outfit. Uh, so clearly I did um, replace. I tried to find the best matching option out of like really just what I saw that she looked like on the gallery. That's how that's the pants that I gave her. My sim self has all my dogs. If you ever need more dogs in the safe. Oh my God, I love that. I love that. And thank you very much for the throne. Friends, if you ever would like to give me very kindly any of the bags, um, you can do so uh, safely through the throne. And I appreciate very, very much. So here we have the club. Only friends to do and not to do is friendly interactions and mean interactions. I kind of couldn't figure out anything. I don't want them to like clean. I don't want them to do like any specific activity like drinking coffee just because I feel like places where they will be meeting or things that Del is a lunar which subscribed at Prime for 10 year months. Oh my god, Lunar, thank you so much for subbing with your Prime even. Enjoy your beautiful emotes. Enjoy one month without any ads. Thank you so much for supporting me. Oh my god, that's so amazing. All the time when someone subscribes for the first time, I'm like, I cannot believe. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Enjoy your subby, enjoy your subby, and thank you once again very much. Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you so much. Um yeah i was thinking uh i was thinking yeah they will probably be doing different things all kinds of different things and uh, like even meeting and at various places and so i didn't want to put anything like super specific in there i love you katie thank you so 
much and the star looks so good next to your name as well i i just love our little badges for bits and for subs i feel like they look so great and it's so lovely to see them next to your names friends thank you so much for supporting me thank you thank you um let's take a look at our pomegranate oh this one we can evolve the other ones friends let's let let me give you like a little tour of what we have so far because there are some new friends in here today uh, maybe the best is afternoon although like it's not the best lighting but this is our little farm friends Lunar underscore Melody subscribed at Prime for 10 year months. Oh my god, Melody also with the Prime me. Thank you so much as well, friends. What is happening? Thank you so much. Thank you also for your subby friends. I don't know what to say. If you like saying thank you is not enough. Thank you, thank you, thank you once again, friends. It looks very... The star looks so amazing next to your name. Thank you so much for your subby as well. I cannot believe... Friends. <clears throat> oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, thank you friends for supporting Quinn and joining Spices. Yes, thank you so much. It's so lovely to see all of you friends being here and, and just having those little stars next to your name. Thank you. Um, and of course supporting me so that I can continue doing this. Thank you so much. Um, so friends, here we are. This is our off-grid farming challenge and this doesn't have like any very specific rules. So far we are very busy just with running everything and really furnishing everything and finding money everywhere or making enough money to like furnish the house and make a greenhouse things like that so so far we are still in the kind of phase where we're trying to make it work at all so this is our main house i will show you inside in a second but this is our main house it's pretty big i feel like it's very decent here we have uh, our cow milkshake, our chickens. We still have some chickens to name, I believe. Um, here is our little horse, Dandelion, that is going to... Choo-choo. Choo-choo. Oh my goodness, I, when I hear choo-choo, I'm like... But thank you so much, Melody, for 100 biddies. Thank you so much. Um, so this is Dandelion that is going to grow up. I think in one day or so, like, like she is really going to grow up, I think, in this episode. Um, then we have, we had garden in here, in around here. And in the last episode, we had enough money to uh, build this little greenhouse. So this has been our dream for a long time. And so we have this little greenhouse uh, where we have all of our little plants in here um, I am so excited because everything is going to be in season in here and I would like to also duplicate this at some point and have at least two of them so I would be very excited for that then once again the main house uh, Chloe, welcome as well 38% spicy we will spice you up but there's already like a really good percentage for for the morning for you how are you doing welcome as well good morning um so the main house is still like kind of empty we are still working on making enough money to furnish it here this is kind of like it will be kind of like living room or like the entry room living room Kind of like a mix i want here to be a tv maybe even a better one some couch things like that here is a kitchen that is like clearly also not finished we didn't have enough money to finish here a little hallway this is going to be a dining room here is the main bedroom for the parents and here is a little downstairs bathroom in the basement we have a little room Excuse for Whatever you are doing, we just received the throne gift. Woohoo! Crisano 3 just gifted the Sims 4 Centimates collection on throne wishlist. Excuse me, everyone, stop whatever you are doing. We just received the throne gift. Woohoo! 
Crisano 3 just gifted The Sims 4 Carnival Streetwear on Throne Wishlist. Chris! Oh my goodness! Thank you so much! Oh my goodness, Chris! Thank you so much for gifting me two kids. Oh my goodness! Friends, what is happening today? Oh my god, I can't help myself with the same skits. Thank you so much for the gifties, Chris. Oh my god, I am so excited. I wanted the sentiments collection for such a long time. Oh my god, thank you so much, Chris. I don't even know what to say. Once again, friends, uh, it feels like saying thank you is not enough. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I'm going to get them right after the stream i am so excited also as is welcome and i saw also chloe was writing something um how are you quinn chloe i'm doing amazing today today i have all the energy how are you doing you're welcome now you can dress um dress up the sims more oh my god chris thank you so much once again i really appreciate oh my god friends everyone is so kind like too kind today thank you so much i don't even know what to say um, sometimes it feels bad to like say thank you and return to the game because I would be thanking for like 10 minutes. I'm like, oh my god, it's it's not enough. I, I just, but I hope you know that I am like really very thankful and I really appreciate. Thank you so much. I am I am really touched. I am really touched. Thank you so much. So I will try to return to the game, friends. Here um, we have like a little basement for nectar making. We will see. Maybe it will have also some other use uh, by the time. Maybe we don't have enough space in the house. Uh, we will see. But so far for nectar making and storing the nectar. And upstairs, here is the hallway. Here we will have a little bathroom. Um, I wanted to have also laundry room in here. Here, this is kind of like a spare room. Maybe it will be an office. Maybe we have like some more children. It will be another room. We will see. And this is, <laughs> there is a lot of hair, but this is the room of our son, Aiden. Uh, also quite empty at this point, but hopefully we will get more money. Like we have been making some decent money in the last episodes. So that's roughly what we are doing, friends, in here. Uh, in this challenge, we are really just taking care of the farm and all the things like that. And yeah, trying to make money to furnish everything and so on and so on. So how is everyone doing? How are the needs? The needs look in a, like decent. <coughs> Sorry, friends. Uh, when is Aiden going to age up? In four days? And then the lion in one day. Then the lion in one day. And the ad adults in 10 days. And in nine days. Okay. So we still have some time with them. And they are still going to be just adults. So that's also that's also quite good. And also, friends, our uh, garden is already producing some like really expensive plants as well so th that has been really helpful as well let me just check whether i can evolve anything but it, it doesn't look like it it still needs some time but we also have bees which are really helping oh my god they're enraged <gasps> oh no okay let's not touch them just now we will take care of that later let me make them a little bit like tired do you CC or mods? So I do use... Uh, let me just send him to sleep as well. I do use mods. I do not use mods that are adding something that the game doesn't have. Like for example, menstruation or things like that. I have only mods which are like UI cheats, for example. So that I can just click on the season and change it, things like that. Or I do have MCC um what else why are you barking is there something happening so i just have these kind of mods i have like mods for wash machines so that they start themselves but otherwise i don't have any like really game changing mods and from cc the only cc i have in my game is the eyelashes wicked whims friends we have to talk about this oh my goodness we have to talk about wicked whims okay so Yesterday, yesterday, I was, I started playing Sims in, in the evening. I started playing Sims in the evening. And I just started my Sims and I don't know, I really don't know 
how this idea came to my mind. But I was like, I never really like checked Wicked Whims. I just know what Wicked Whims is. I know what it has, but I like never really saw it. So I started, I started an incognito window. I was like, I cannot even be looking through this through my like default browser, anything. I have to go through the incognito window. I was like, do I use VPN from this for this? So I opened Wicked Whims. I started going through the content. I started going through the content. And I was like digging deep into the content. It was not like I just looked and I stopped looking. I was like, I spent hour just being fast. Excuse me, everyone. Stop whatever you are doing. We just received the throne gift. Woohoo! Brashensis has just gifted the Sims for Nifty Knitting on Throne Wishlist. Excuse me, everyone. Stop whatever you are doing. We just received the throne gift. Woohoo! Brashensis has just contributed $21.62 towards the Sims 4 Stranger of the Lawn Throne wishlist. Wait! Brash Nifty Knitting and Stranger Wall? Brash, I don't deserve this! Oh my god, thank you so much! Also, two packs that I wanted for so long! Rash, thank you so much. No, but it has been crowdfunded. Like, it has been finished. Let me pause the recording. Friends, I'm sorry. I just needed a little bit of a break. Uh, after all the very lovely friends uh, gifted me some very lovely packs. So, we are back. I, I had to pause the recording. We can hold while you call Spice Mom. Listen, she will know about this a minute. I stopped the stream. I'm calling her to tell her. Spice Mom needs to know everything. Nine Mom Mom. So, yeah, I, want, I was, oh my god, it's raining. This is the weather here also, like, in real life where I am right now. And friends, I have to ask this. Do you like when it's raining? I'm not saying like when it's raining for a week. But do you like an occasional rainy day? Because I have to say I love it because it forces me to stay home and just relax. Because when it's sunny outside, I still feel like I have to go outside. And if I just relax at home, I nearly feel um, uh, guilty in a way. Love the rain. Hamburger the same. I love the rain. Harley as well. I love rainy, rainy days to relax and sim. Exactly. I feel like it's such a good excuse to just stay home. Rain over snow. It's been snowing for three days here in Canada. Oh my god. Let's go. Uh, it's going to be 70 and sunny here today. 21. Um, Chris, we also have had like today. I think we also had like 20 degrees Celsius in here. Um, and then it started raining, but it's getting like really warm in here. But today it has been raining, but it really forces me sometimes to, um, to just relax. And friends, we have a poll rain on or sunshine. So I have to say in general, it's sunshine for me, uh, but occasional rainy day, even on a weekend feels just so good because it's a good excuse to just stay home for me definitely all the time friends look at this all beautiful produce that we have let me check whether we can um, evolve anything Doo -doo 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 -doo. nothing so far but we have to wait for the bees bees are ready um if it's sunny and i don't go out i feel guilty s is the same same here where i live they say we get 350 days of sun per year Okay, that's a little bit like a lot. Um, it's four Celsius here no, right now. I just want the warmth. I understand. I understand, Melody. It's going to come. Anyways, back to talking about the, the wicked whims. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We. Yeah. I. I have to continue that because um, it kind of like stopped. 
I love a good rainy day. Um, I will gladly stay in and read or game or whatever. Same. It's sunny today, but it's cold. So gladly st staying in today. Yeah, I feel like we are really on the same page with that. Like everyone just loves a good excuse to stay home. But friends, back to the wicked whims, okay? So I spent like one hour just going through all the different mothers that do like those animations for wicked whims. I have not been ready. My virgin eyes have not been ready for this. I always fought of the sims as like a very family friendly game not even talking about sims 4 that is even more family friendly than i like it to be like seeing the body parts that i never thought the sims have i never think of sims to have body parts you know other than fingers well, they had many fingers, let me tell you that. Um, and the animations and things like that, I was like, what the hell? This is, like, this is not even what I think Woohoo is. This is not what I think they do when they Woohoo, you know? <sighs> so I was... Let's say there was some voice chat happening, or voice call. I entered the voice call and I was like, can I please talk to all of you about my recent trauma? And I think everyone was like, oh my goodness, is she going to like trauma dump about some family situation? And I started talking about my experience. Everyone was laughing and I was like, I, I, I just don't know. But I have to, I have to admit, I'm like kind of intrigued try it in my game okay i'm like not it was just a shock and oh my god friends i also have to admit something else let's return let's finish talking about wicked whims but friends it is definitely an experience but again it adds something to the sims that it's missing like now just on the practical side and really just like yeah, really just practical side. It even has like 15k supporters on Patreon, like financial supporters. And I do understand it. Like some people really want this in their game. And this is aspect that is missing in The Sims. Sims is such a family friendly game right now that, uh, yeah, we are back in recording. Um, Sims is such a family friendly game that some people might find it boring. They, and this is exactly the nice thing. Everyone can just customize their experience, how they are playing. And I think it is fantastic that even mods like this exist. Like it gives you warning when you are entering the page, like, hey, this is 18 plus content, things like that. And I do think it is a good thing. It's like watching your childhood show when they make another version that is 18 plus. Yeah, definitely. I've seen pics in my Discord, in a Discord before for 18 plus Sims, I have to say. Yeah, it is like really, if you are not used to it or maybe like you don't want it in your game, it can be a little bit shocking. But again, it's just that Sims is a very family friendly game and I feel like you don't expect that. Um, so yeah, it was an experience. <gasps> oh my god, friends, he's peeing in the shower! Oh my god, I never noticed this. He's peeing in the shower. Because I... His, his bladder need was low, so I told him to go to the toilet, but it's going up. <laughs> I never noticed this. You. Lilo, welcome, first of all. Today, what what a moment to come into. Lilo, we have already been talking about Wicked Whims. Now we are talking about him being in the shower, like, today. 
For anyone who this was not clear to, this is 18 plus stream. It has always been. Lilo 62. Lilo is also bringing a, a good spice, so so that is good. It's like that sometimes, yeah. It's like that sometimes. Okay. Oh my god, it's 9 a.m. and it's so dark. Siv, we will carry you. We will absolutely carry you. Everyone, hi, spicy. Is it just you, really, Siv? With like a little bit lower spicy? Okay, so let's take care of everything we need to take care of. Oh, and it's also Harvest Fest. Oh, friends, I would have forgotten. Um, so, first things first. It is already 9 a.m. Today, there is no school, no work. Oh, there is work. And there is school. Wh why don't you go to work then? Okay, so they go to work. And we have to take care of everything. It's so dark considering it's 9 a.m. How is Dandelion doing? Oh, excellent. Perfect. Perfect. She, she is just running around. I think she doesn't mind... Um, the rain she has this little place here regardless if she does toilet no shower yes totally who else hates the gnomes and harvest fest i always sell them and then changes uh change the tradition so i kind of like nearly don't mind them mm, yeah I, I i i i don't mind them i don't mind the tradition but i also always sell them just because they are selling for like what two three hundred each or something like that friends let's take care oh my god oh my god look we have first aubergines we can sell them we can harvest them and make make like a jam or whatever it's called we can can them canning mushroom okay mm, meat substitute okay friends we should start canning what do you think i have been thinking about this i have also been kind of like just researching a little bit lately uh about canning in general and i think it's so cute i haven't done that before me neither and i have been researching just to see whether there is any like use for them for those cans that you make or concerts or whatever uh gems anything whether there is any use for them and it looks like not really maybe like meat substitute you can use for vegetarian dishes things like that but there doesn't seem to be like very constant need or use or whatever but you can sell them and i feel like it would be kind of like a nice way to make some additional money there is always one that i can never please i'm like you f you you can leave i just do random things uh, I hate that you have to give a toy to the naked gnome to appease it. I never knew that it's like concrete things. I just always do the random things. My Sim uh, did make meat substitutes once, but never used it. I think there is like a use for them. I think you can very specifically use them for vegetarian dishes. When you have something that normally has meat, you can use it um, for that. So, there is one thing that I never can figure out. Status healthy, status fine. Yeah, I can just never figure out whether they can grow even more or whether this is the maximum that they will grow. But I think it is maximum. And this, I also think it's maximum. So we should harvest these. Harvest this. This one clearly still still needs needs some time. Oh my god, I can't speak. Evie is off to work. Please work hard. And oh, don't run inside. Oh my god, he's going to get stung by the bees. No, don't run. And it looks like we have to take care of the bees. Uh, apply mite treatment. Don't 
so you not subscribed at dear one for two months. Late but here I am. Never late. First of all, just on time. Though we welcome to the stream. Welcome. So lovely to see you. And thank you so much for the two months. Enjoy your uh, beautiful emotes and enjoy not having to watch any ads. And thank you so much for supporting me along the way. Welcome. Welcome. How are you doing, Doey? Today we are playing our farming challenge. Thank you so much once again for the two months. Today, everyone is so generous and just too kind to me. I am getting like a little bit emotional. We went through all kinds of emotions here today, friends. We went through like dancing and too much energy to me now being like all emotional. Let's see where it where, where it takes us. Let's see where we will still go. Hello, Queenie. Hello, Stephen Chat. Hello, hello, welcome. Going to the store uh, to buy po po pots to uh, repot uh, all my house plants. Let's go, Melody. Hopefully, we will see you later or then maybe next time. But have a have a good shopping um, experience. Oh wow, Doey, coming in here with 91% spicy very clearly. It's the resub day. It it feels like the resub days always are very spicy. Always very spicy. But thank you so much once again. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Why are you running inside? Waking up spicy. I love that. We absolutely love that. Especially being spicy in the morning. Sometimes, friends, I am... Why are you? Oh, don't, don't run. Don't run inside. Okay. Okay, they are irritated. Bond? What will happen if I bond? Bond. He's running because of the uh, the stupid thunderstorm. But oh my goodness, Dandelion, what are you doing here inside, friends? This is reminding me of some of those videos where in real life some horse really comes inside by accident because it doesn't know that it's inside. Oh my god, Dandelion! I mean, it's okay. You can be here. Dandelion is scared of the storm too. So I have been thinking, friends, because this is like Dandelion's place in here. I have been thinking we will sell some of our crops here. And so we could build some walls around like three, like here outside. We could build walls and put maybe some windows or something. We just need money, which we will get right now because we will sell most of our crops. The normal are also scared of the storm. That's why they come inside. Really? Oh my god, that's true, because they were here before. They were here before. Oh my goodness. Wow. What does ominous mean? I really don't know. The gnomes are so ominous. Okay, he's bonding with the bees. Scary. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know. I... I feel like I care less about them than most of the people. About the gnomes. Let's bond also with these. Giving the impression that something bad or unpleasant is going to happen. Threatening. Inauspicious. Inauspicious. Threatening. Okay. Hmm. Creep and forebo foreboding. Like bad things are about to happen. Okay, and gnomes are like that. Okay. I don't know, I just don't care about them. This is the thing, I just... But I know many people are like actively dislike them. Let's collect honey. Finally, we have some honey. Just don't run. Don't run. Don't run. Someone is calling. Lunch of sadness. Some other kid threatened Aiden and took his lunch money. He has been crying in the office. Find the kid or I will. He needs to stand up for himself. I would say, find the kid or I will. Yeah. The poor kid. No. Okay. As a parent, I say, find the kid or I will. Me too. Just because it, it has to be very difficult for a child 
to stand against someone who stole their money, you know? Like, that's, I think, not the situation that you should force your child to do. Oh. Like, some children would do it by themselves, but, yeah. Friends, oh my god, we have our first Ooh. money! Uh, not money, honey! <laughs> we have our first honey! Collect wax as well. I kind of forgot what we can use. Oh, we can use wax for um, candles, for example. Let's collect honey. Our bees delivering. I mean, honey and money. You know, we can still send, sell it. Let me take... Um, I'm currently building a basement summoning room with a coffin and some Deepak babies. So I'm trying to lean into those ominous vibes. Sif, is it the house that you are building for the family that you submitted for me? And that is in the save file? Those children don't deserve this, this uh, trauma. <laughs> Um, it's another house. Okay. Okay. I'm building my house to restart the not so bare. Oh my god, Chris, that is so exciting. So exciting. Can you please collect the honey? And maybe I will even take a little screenshot of this moment. Oh my god, this looks so good and so exciting. So let me, friends, take a little... A little thumbnail. Okay. Yay, friends, look! This is going to be really nice thumbnail. I wish it was sunny in a way, but it's still going to be nice. Let's take it like this. Yeah, I feel like this one is the best we can do let me try once again from this side no just from this side that is super cute yeah we have our first honey can you believe it or maybe also like this let's try this as well <gasps> friends we have money uh, then I will do Sims in Bloom after Not So Berry, and then whichever challenge sounds fun after that. Oh my god, so many challenges to do. So many challenges to do. All with the same family, oh my god. Uh, I don't think I have ever played any of the challenges, maybe I should look into them. Crystal, I feel like it can be so much fun. Like, it forces you? Wait a second. Uh, I'm thinking whether I want also this as a screenshot, but maybe that one. Yeah, let me take this as well. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I feel like it sometimes forces you to play in the ways that you normally wouldn't. At least it does force me. Like, for example, this challenge super much. I never before or very rarely, like maybe once, I played with bees. Um, I never play really with these crops. Also with like all the animals and everything. So I feel like it really just forces you to do uh, different things. Excuse me, sir. There is a bee in your beard. Yeah, there are many of them. Bees everywhere. Oh no, they're attacking him. So, friends. Let's uh, harvest everything. Let's water all. Oh, Sims crash! No! Uh, Sims, uh, uh, Sims, Sif, where have you saved? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, we should save. <gasps> Friends, everyone safe. Good call. I don't know where I saved last. And did you do like really a lot of progress? Oh no, that's terrible. Sif, I'm so sorry. 
That sucks all the time when you lose your progress, no matter which game, no matter what you are doing. I'm so sorry for that, really. No! I won't use my points for anything. I'm saving for something special. Oh, at some point... Our insect farm has been struck by lightning. Fantastic. Yeah, oh, oh, 07 for the bucks. Oh no. So it will be okay. Okay, perfect. Nice to hear. Like, it's just so annoying when you have to do the same things. Like, mostly you even remember exactly what you did. So it's like, technically, it's not such a big deal, but just doing all the things that you have already done once. Very annoying. Very annoying, I would say. Okay. Why are you running all the time? We're even in a greenhouse. Okay. Um, okay, Aiden is back from school. He's still an A student. Can you do your homework? <laughs> Or wheat. Okay, talk to Aiden. That's great. And also, we should weed these, harvest everything. And Aiden, can you maybe then... Oh no, Dandelion is sleeping here. Oh, little baby. She just a baby. Look at this little baby. She just a baby. Oh, such a baby. Okay, so then we will not wake her up. Let's see, maybe she wakes up a little bit later. Oh, Evie! Evie has made some money. And she needs to increase her research and debate. First, she needs to calm down. Because she's very stressed from work. So let's calm down first. And she then she will practice her debate. Perfect. And... We have to also... Oh my goodness. Shoo away! Go away! Go away! Shoo! Yeah, leave our chickens alone. Um, call over milkshake. Um, the chicken cube is a little bit dirty. Collect eggs. And clean coop. Also clean shed. Clean milkshake um, and milk milkshake. And in the meanwhile, I will take a look. Oh, we have seven eggs. Seven eggs. None of them is hatchable. So let me open the fridge. Oh, we still have 13 eggs in here. He will be hit by lightning in 3, 2, 1. Oh, no, don't... No. Mm -mm. No, please, no. Oh, my God. If that happens, I will be like, Sims is testing me. Okay, I will just... I know that you cannot see behind my face, but I will really just put some things in here that we don't have. Oh, my God, let me put honey. Oh, my God, I'm so excited. So, friends, we have our first honey. Um, and the rest, I believe we have everything. Um, pears. The fridge. Okay, we don't have pears. We put pears in there. Oh my god, we will have a little chicken, friends! Oh my god, let's, let's, uh, hatch it in a second. How about onions? We have carrots. I think carrots are new. So carrots I will put right there. Um, green beans. Okay, green beans we have there. Pepper. These are raspberries. We have grapes. We have... 
blueberries we don't okay blueberries choco berries we have okay so i can sell everything else i got honey for you honey oh yes we have some honey friends let's sell first of all let's check the snapdragons okay Oh my goodness, just the snapdragons are going to be 600. One thousand five hundred. Not too bad. Oh my god, fertilizer, vitality fertilizer and the super vitality fertilizer. <laughs> fertilizer. Yeah. Exciting, friends. We have nearly 2,000 simoleons. We can build something again. We're exciting. We're exciting. And in the meanwhile, in the meanwhile, we should also take care of this harvest fest. So let's prepare. Oh, wait, we don't have a stove, but we will buy. Oh, friends, just this stove is 2,700. So I think we will have to just give up on it this time. Can you replace your crispy box? <laughs> yeah, we can. We definitely can. Friends, I think we will have to just give up on this right now because this uh, stove costs 2,700. So we will buy it later because that's just too much stuff that we could have instead. So I think we will use, for example, this one for now. Or even maybe this one for 400 yeah let's just use this one for now and we will change it eventually okay to have uh, the one from that kit so it's so rainy i don't see anything oh it's um it's autumn in in the game right because it's harvest fest very very exciting and can I get the end piece as well? Let me put my cheats in. <laughs> Not the crispy bugs. Yeah, they are like they're literally crispy bugs at this point. <laughs> A poor box. Friends. Wait, okay. So here we are missing still some. Okay. Is this the correct one? Yeah, it's the end piece. Okay, maybe I will rather use this one. Uh, wait. Let me build a fake wall and put how do I not have money again? Wait. She is a spender. She is investing. Uh, wait. Ah, oh, friends, you know what I'm... <gasps> yes let's go perfect no but what did i spend so much money on uh. <gasps> oh my goodness but we have a functional kitchen we have a functional kitchen can we buy like a sofa at this point Friends, has any, uh, is there anyone who doesn't have, how is it called once again? Uh, mm, who doesn't have the backyard stuff pack and hasn't claimed it for free from the EA app yet. Friends, now is the time, okay? I don't know for how much longer. It is going to be free, but Backyard Stuff Pack is free right now. 
you just have to go into your EA app and you have to claim it. You have to kind of like buy it for free, save it into your library, even if you are not going to download it right now into your computer, but it's free, save it, kind of like buy it for free, claim it. We don't know. I, I kind of don't know how, how much longer it's going to be. I know there is some date or something, but I don't remember. So don't miss out. Don't miss out, friends, on this. Um, okay. What happens if I sell these? Okay. We have many, many more sofas available. So we should... Oh my god, should we maybe use this one? But We should maybe buy some sofa. But friends, first let's take a little break. I am pausing the recording. Friends on YouTube, we are back. We had a little self-care break and I just opened the game and I realized that we still don't have any stairs here. So let me buy those stairs. As many times they could just run through here. And I... Like, it was meant to have stairs here. We just didn't have enough money before. So that's perfect. We call three cream, three sugar, triple tripper. It's pretty common. I heard about double double. Uh, and yeah, triple triple. Then it just makes like all the sense. But uh, okay, interesting. Interesting, interesting. Oh, look, we have a little patio now. Inter not interesting, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So we have 300 more simoleons. How does this happen all the time, friends? Can someone please explain? All the time I'm like, yay, we have 2,000 simoleons, we can buy all the things, and then we have like nothing, nothing left. But what do we buy for the 300? Yeah, I wanted to buy a sofa of some sort. Oh, but I did buy stairs, so now I don't have enough money for the sofa nearly. But which one would I like to buy if I had the money? Uh, do, 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 do. Maybe something like this. Or like this. Something that is giving like cabin vibes in a way. Or maybe this one. Oh, sorry. Or maybe this one or this one. Uh, things are pricey. Time to save and get more money. So it's the constant cycle of us in the morning, like getting the milk and eggs and all the plants and everything. And so we, what is this? Is this the trash plant? Oh my goodness. I don't want that. So we always have some money in the morning and I'm like, oh my God, finally I can buy everything I ever wanted. Then I buy like two things and we don't have any money again. So it's just constant cycle of those two phases all the time but back to the game we can cook grand meal oh my goodness i forgot that we are on um, simple living so even with grand meals we can cook only the things that we have ingredients for uh, when those two things are expensive counters yeah, I don't, I don't regret anything, but this kitchen has been like really expensive. And I still don't even have this stove that costs like 2,700. And I feel like it's a good choice that we made for now to have just this stove right, right here. So we will eventually, when we have all the furnishings and everything, uh, we will change it. But for now, this one will just do its job. So friends, once again, we cannot even make turkey because we don't have any meat. Oh, we have only red meat. Ah, okay. Friends, so for harvest fest, we are going to have fish, okay? We are going to have fish. <coughs> Once again, fish. Okay. And what are you doing? Oh, he's cleaning. The shed. Perfect. Oh no! Wait, 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 wait. 
our power, like whatever it's called, I always call them something like power generators, whatever. They are broken. <gasps> okay, we don't have too much power. So I feel like I should sell the water. We always have so much water. Let's let's keep it. But we don't have enough power. So we will have to clean this and also repair. <gasps> Both of them need to be repaired. Oh no, oh no, friends. The game is testing me. The game is testing me. It's gonna be all good. <gasps> oh my goodness, did you see it? The chicken did beat up the fox. And the fox is leaving! Oh my god, which chicken was it? It was a nameless chicken, friends! A nameless chicken! And... We have some eggs that are ready to... Hatch. Oh my goodness, we should hatch those eggs, let's go. Friends, look now, we are going to have a little chicken from the egg, okay? This is a very cute thing to see. So, friends, look. Who wants to name our most power powerful rooster? Friends, we still have some um, chickens without a name. Oh, my goodness. Yay, we have a new chicken. Oh, so cute. I wish it was not raining. It would be such a cute screenshot. We will have one more chicken. Uh, this one? Yeah, hatch. Oh, let's go! Cute. Dandelion, what are you doing in here? This horse, always somewhere. So. Our most powerful rooster should be named Sif. <laughs> oh my god, Chris, I love that. Sif, do you want to be... The names of these, so one is Beaches, one is Riley, one is KFC. Okay? Sif, do you want it? Let me know if you don't want it, I will rename the rooster sure okay let's go uh a piece of gnome give coffee you too peace give toy you too a piece give salad and we have our fish dinner so come and call to grand meal Chicken Civ is powerful. True. True, true, true. And we should be thankful. It's a Thanksgiving little celebration. <gasps> Why are you sad? Feeling hurt by someone nearby? Ooh. <gasps> Aiden misses their animal friend. A friend that would still be here if Henry hadn't traded it away <gasps> oh my god friends this is not the mod this is in the game so we traded our i think it was chickens that would kind of like die that were already like really old so they would die and we traded them for meat and now he has a bad sentiment Oh my god, I didn't know that was a sentiment. Me neither. Is there a stinky cheese, Kappa? Is it Kappa? Yeah. I don't think we do have that yet, uh, Chris, but if you would like. Oh, this is Sif, this is Riley, this is KFC, Black Hen. Stinky cheese, Kappa. Oh my god, let's go. Oh my god, all this hair. 
We should clean it. Oh, we should get also one more chair. Okay, that's, that's good. It's just 30 simoleons. Okay, grab that. I will put it into the fridge for now. And they should just be thankful. Whoa, an animal shed. How are you thinking about this? We are having a dinner. We are having a dinner. I think it will be in deep thoughts. No, where it where where will it be? Um maybe in small talk? Small talk? Um no, okay, where else? <gasps> yeah, here it is. Oh no! Oh no, I missed it! Uh, friends, should we have one more baby? Oh my god, it was here. Okay. Compliments? No. Stink high cheese, 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 124 septillion, 857 sextillion, 643 quintillion, 545 quadrillion, 876 trillion, 854 billion, 548 million, 357,845. Chris. Thank you so much for stinking up the place with your cheeses. The cheeses being stinky. And for the beautiful number. What is that number? Chris, what is the number? Thank you very much. I love that you let Quinn taste her own uh, favorite troll method. What are you talking about? This is not trolling. It's just a number. Oh, we love Chris stinking it up. We also do love stinky cheeses, don't we? Friends, I do like stinky cheese in real life. Do you know uh, that I only use the numbers in your chat? Oh my goodness! Not in Carl's chat. <coughs> Probably the amount of hours I play Sims makes sense. Makes all the sense. Okay, so they're having like a nice harvest fest dinner. It should be turkey. It's not. It's uh, it's fish, but that's okay. Okay, perfect. Okay, so everyone is having perfect perfect harvest fest. And can Aiden? Can you? No, he cannot clean all of that. Clean up all the hair piles because this is embarrassing. <gasps> Does she have to do it one by one? Oh no, we should get this Roomba. Hmm. Oh, but I can drag all of it in here. Let's go, because it's annoying. Okay. Okay, okay. It's Thursday in the game, which means that the next day is going to be Friday. So, friends, maybe the next day in the game we could um, go out with our mums of Hamford. I really wish EA let you uh, share saves across computers like Steam does. I want to play my Sims game that is on my laptop, but I don't want to get um, the external hard drive to move it over. Oh, I get your point. So, so you like have two computers. And you would like to be able to play it on both of them, right? Yeah, that is understandable. Beaches, welcome! What have I missed? So, there has been... A throne party earlier. Um, I think it was like... Four or five? Four or five? I think five... Uh, packs have been very kindly gifted. And other than that, we have been just chilling. It is raining. It, it has been raining in the game. So uh, it's a little bit dark in the game. Uh, but yeah. Sometimes I want uh, to sit at my desk, sometimes not. Yeah, I understand totally. Sometimes I would like to play from my bed. When I was playing on the laptop, I used to be playing from my bed so much. And I really loved it. <gasps> 
God, friends, we have 900. <gasps> friends, we have 900 new simoleons. Let me see, because it's a little bit um, laggy. <gasps> you have missed the throne party. Oh, friends, I'm so sorry. Oh, sometimes really this timing you know that some things just happen like in one moment i understand it totally sometimes i also miss like things like this oh i'm so sorry uh i love sitting on the sofa with the dogs playing sims yeah totally don't go crazy with it with with what i don't know what i was saying just right now so i am i am not sure uh the money oh yeah you know that i am going to get crazy with it so yeah we wanted the sofa let's spend it all let's spend it all so i am thinking maybe something like this one how do we feel about this sofa uh, or this one is cute. Maybe this one. Hmm. And now I should choose, right? Do I have to buy just one? Do I have to buy just one? Does this one have also a matching chair? Oh, I think I will have to... Oh, it does! <gasps> Friends, I never use this one because it looks a little bit like kind of old. So how do we feel about using this one? 600, oh my goodness. Maybe in this swatch. Maybe they got it from the thrift store. Yeah, I feel like um, this house should look a little bit old, you know? Maybe they like got it from some family or something. So I would maybe go with this swatch. And I feel like it has some magic to it. There are some other swatches. But not for 600 simoleons. That is expensive thrift store. Absolutely. Absolutely. And we can also change it to this like more creamy one. If we maybe want some rug with some pattern or something like that. Yeah, let's go with this. Let's give it some color. Let's give it some color. Let's make it interesting. So we have either this chair, which doesn't look comfortable at all. Or we have this one that we just exactly don't have money for. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Uh, I keep seeing crazy thrift store prices online and in person, so it tracks. Hmm. I feel like sometimes there are those like fake thrift stores. Uh, mostly I don't like shop for furniture, but for clothes, let's say, where they're acting like it's a thrift store and exactly then they give it high prices and I'm like, <coughs> sorry friends. And then I'm like, what's the point? I feel like they just want to call it thrift store so that it's interesting, but they like really give it very high prices. Um, so it's missing the point, in my opinion, if you ask me. Okay. So we bought one sofa. <laughs> oh my goodness. We should do something to get some more money. Evie, can you get promoted? She should practice her debate. Uh, will it help you if you are confident? Uh, 
I did go and buy all the Twilight books at the thrift store for only 10 total. Well, that's exactly how it should be. That's exactly how it should be. Oh, is it not the confident? I think confident... Um, I thought the confident one will give you a boost, but... I like how she's practicing her research and debate. Meanwhile, her man is here showering. Very nice. Very nice. And Aiden is just cross stitching. Very cute. Uh, is this your first time reading the series? What if I tell you I have never read it? And I have like. Oh no, this is broken as well. Do I at this point just hire a repair service? Let's just repair it ourselves. But it's starting to be a little bit much to repair. We have to also repair these. Uh, I was obsessed with Twilight in my adolescence, but I no longer have my copies. Oh, really? Uh, I have read it a, mi a billion times. I just sold all the physical books when I moved across the country 12. Oh, I see. I have my comfort books. I like to reread when I really uh, want to read, but don't know what to read. Makes sense. And do you have all of them at home or do you also go to the library? Beaches, thank you so much for being so generous and gifting a subby to Crystal. Oh my god, thank you so much, Crystal. You now have a subby. Enjoy your emotes. Enjoy not having to watch any ads for one month and all that thanks to Beaches. Let's go. Oh my god, everyone is so generous today. What is happening? I have a hard time remembering to return library books, so I just buy them. Makes sense. You are all being very nice today. Yeah, everyone is like very generous today. Thank you so much. And yeah, Crystal, let's go with all those emotes. I love them. Enjoy. Thank you so much for being so generous. Thank you. Yeah, again, I don't know what to say. It feels like saying thank you is not enough, but thank you. Yeah. <gasps> Friends, the game wants us to swap the personality of Henry from being slob to being neat. Can we get, like, very quick, or okay, I see also in the, in the chat already, so maybe we don't need a poll. I feel like that is a real grow up. I don't I didn't know that's possible. Amazing. Yeah. Friends, I feel like let's talk about this. I haven't like thought about this thing to do it myself. But when we think about what he is doing the whole days right now because his wife is working at school as a teacher like at this point, elementary school teacher. She's all the time at work. Uh, and it's mostly really him taking care of the garden, of the animals, like even cleaning, like the shed and, and things like that. So I feel like maybe he was a little bit slobby as like teenager or when he was growing up. But maybe now that he has so much responsibility and he has to really keep things in place. He really became neat. Friends. Uh, I have grown up like that in the last five years too. Really, Chris? I love that. Okay, and I see, friends, that you are also very much... Um, you, like, agree to do this? I agree too. We love a good ca character arc. Yeah, I agree. Let's go. I love this for him. Wow. I was never, or I have never been thinking of him like of a neat sim, really. But okay, it makes sense. 
Oh my god, poor Evie, it's going so slow for her. And she is also starting to burn out. Oh my god, okay. In that case, just uh, take care of your meat and go to sleep. Okay, he is doing all this stuff during the night. Harvest fest success. Oh, harvest fest successful. Everyone had uh, a nice harvest fest. In the beginning, they had it kind of divided. Evie was taking care of something. Uh, Henry was taking care of something. Right now, it's really mostly Evie being. <gasps> He cannot die. He cannot die, dies. <sighs> Screenshots. Sabrina! Hi, I miss you. I'm uh, over at my friend's house having a girl's painting day. Oh my god, I've been wanting to come say hi. Sabrina, have the bestest day. We're having a little bit uh, of a hard time right now. <laughs> but have the bestest day. It was so nice to see you. Thank you so much. I was wondering why the stream was quiet. I walked away and he gets electro electrocuted. Girl, right now, the last thing we need you to be is energized. Girl, Evie, listen. Let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. Evie, you will be nice and sad. You need to be sad for Grim to see how much sorrow he's bringing to this family. So he lets him live, okay? Evie, you wake up, you be sad, okay? You run there, you talk to Grim, all good, okay? Evie, I trusted you. <sighs> I did walk in on a dramatic moment. Oh my goodness, yes, absolutely. Uh -huh. Evie, Evie, come here. <gasps> Oh my god, okay, more screenshots, more screenshots, more passion, more screenshots. <laughs> Sif! Oh okay, Evie, I trust in you, okay, Evie, it's up to you. Run! Be sad! Be sad! Evie, be sad!
it was not the research and debate skill. You know? She used her arguments. She used, you know, she debated. She brought the arguments to the table. And Grimm just understood. He was just trying to fix our solar panels so that we can be more eco-friendly. You can let him... Exactly. She brought the arguments to the table. This woman... Deserves a promotion. <gasps> Friends, can you believe this? I was so sure. I was so sure that this will not happen. Because from my experience, it only happens when the sim who is pleading is super sad. That the sim pleading becomes sad. And in that moment, Grim is like, okay, but she's energized. So that's why I was like, okay, he's just dead. Like, like that's the thing. He is going to be dead. And in my mind, I was already like, what do I do? What do I do? I was like, do I restart the game? Because I just saved before. Or do we just like play and try to resurrect him and do like all this ambrosia stuff? I was really already like, oh my goodness, Sims, you are testing me, friends. Napping before work. Claw, you never again apologize for napping, okay? Never. And welcome from a nap. You came just in the good moment. And we totally support napping before work, okay? He just realized he likes uh, picking up trash. You can't kill him now. Exactly. Exactly. All the arguments. And it's even repaired. So we should thank Grim. Or is he like leaving? Friends. Save. The game is testing me. The game is testing me. In the beginning, I was like, today we will just make some money. We will go out with our girls, you know, and uh, do like whatever. Go for a coffee with friends. How should I go for a coffee when all of this is happening? And they told her she would never use those debate skills. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, what other more important thing you can use it for, you know? This is like... <gasps> Dandelion, why are you sad? Betty's four being brought back to life. Beaches, thank you so much for, for the life, Bitties. For the Bitties, for being brought back to life. Listen, Dandelion, uh, you have... You are very sad from witnessing that of a friend. He is not dead, so bye. And my favorite song is on. Go to sleep, Sims. Oh, she's so confident. Show me what I got. <laughs> Resurrection biddies, yes. Oh my goodness. Now I am happy I made those screenshots. And poor Aiden doesn't even know. He will probably never know that something like this happened. Why are you sad? <coughs> Oh my goodness. So, let's talk about... Oh, Chris. Thank you. Let's save the game. Let's save the game. Friends, why do my sims always get electrocuted? Was it because there is some water or it was raining and he, he was... Um, 
preparing this? Like, what is the reason for them to always get electrocuted? Okay, he doesn't even know that something like this happened. Rain with the electronics makes sense to be to be fair. Makes all the sense. Evie is going to work. Oh, poor Evie. Yeah, just go to work. We need that money. Take shower. Water plus electricity bad. But it was not even raining. Like that's my point. That I didn't even send him there when it was raining. And there was also no water puddle or anything like that. So that's why I am so confused. Um, get yourself some leftovers. <gasps> oh no, she was showering in front of in front of him. You shower once again. Big shower. Friends, I'm still like just um, digesting what happened. Maybe it's a thing with the solar panels, like the Murphy bed, pull out bed. Oh, that could also be a thing. That could most definitely be a thing. Like there is some chance to, you know, just die. Uh, harvest all. And. Is there anything I can evolve? Because I love evolving our plants. Do, 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 do. Not really anything. So I should harvest our mushrooms. Can't I? It looks like it's not yet ready. Yeah, nothing is ready yet. What did we find? Oh, we found um, this little statue, whatever it's called. Interesting. <coughs> whatever. <gasps> we have a nectar. I will just put it here into our little rack. Uh, the bug. Yes, the bug house did get struck. We, we did notice that earlier. Oh, but we don't have money to replace it. And it's kind of not the priority. Oh my god, look at this plant. Oh my god, orb stalk. All orb stalk. Interesting. Friends. Oh, we found a pear as well. Friends, let me save. I feel like I have been tested enough in this game today. I wanted to do many things, uh, kind of like, as I said, I wanted the girls to go out and things like that, but other things have been happening, right? Other things have been happening, so it is a little bit out of my control, so I feel like this would be it for The Sims for right now. Friends on Twitch, we are not leaving yet, okay? Uh, let's just say bye to our YouTube friends because I feel like this has been a lot. I still have to process everything that has happened and maybe think about what should happen next. Friends, if you would like to say bye to our YouTube friends. Also, Julian, hi, welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? Welcome. So, friends on YouTube, uh, I don't know what to say. I had so many plans and he just nearly died, you know, many things are keeping us very busy. So let's see what happens in the next episode. Maybe in the next episode, we finally manage to do this little like meeting of the club. That would be amazing. But friends on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Friends on Twitch, thank you so much for saying bye to our YouTube friends. YouTube friends, once again, if you ever feel like joining us. Uh, all the instructions are in the description of the YouTube video. We would love to have you here, really. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time. Bye-bye!